Well, hey guys, thanks for joining me. Today, we are in Lexington, North Carolina, out on High Rock Lake. Uh, we put in at the Southmont boat access area, and little backstory is when I got here, I was like, this place looks really familiar. I think I fished out of this launch for uh, one of my QC tournaments. Uh, that, and I didn't do, do so well on it. Uh, it was not memorable, I'll put it that way. Uh, and I actually like looked in my videos and tried to find this launch and I couldn't find it. So, I'm doing another video out here. So, uh, but this will be an official video uh, featuring the Southmont boat access area. Well, that's enough of me talking. Let's go try to put some fish in the boat. Hopefully you can see this first little fish of the day look at him I don't know maybe 14 inches a little large mouth look at him look at this guy top water all right let's get him back in the water There's fish down there. I've been marking them like crazy. Um, there's bigger ones than that. So let me see if we can get some uh, get some bigger ones in there. All right, let's get them back in the water. been a long time without a bite all right just a real little largemouth here look at him beautiful fish though small but beautiful look at him all right not exactly putting a hurting on him but at least I caught this little guy let's get him back in the water This is a pretty lake. I don't know what mountain is that Uwari? I don't know what mountains those are, but I wasn't expecting to see mountains out here. Look at that. guy that's a nice little large mouth look at him look at this guy all right the bites have been few and far between but we're putting a couple in the boat 
Let's get him back in the water. All right, nice try, little fella. And now it's time for <laughs> Tackle Roundup. All right, guys, um, I've been fishing with all kinds of stuff uh, and not really hitting on a lot. I, I've caught fish that have been on like different stuff. Uh, first thing this morning, uh, I was using a buzz bait and then uh, I caught one on uh, I caught that white bass on a crankbait and I think I caught another one on a drop shot and then now uh, I'm gonna kind of stick with this this is a shaky head zoom trick worm and the color is brown orange swirl now the weight that I'm using is a uh, it's a 1 8 ounce shaky head it's kind of hard to do because it's, it's pretty windy um, hopefully the, the sound is coming out but uh, that's what I'm using, and the color, it is my favorite uh, shaky head color. It is the Zoom Brown Orange Swirl. It is a Academy Sports only color, and it's also been discontinued. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's a good color, uh, and it's discontinued for some reason. But that's what I'm using is this, the Zoom brown orange swirl and that concludes today's <laughs> tackle roundup did up under that dock. Well, that was a pretty epic skip. <laughs> Heck yeah. All right, again, only catching these little, you know, 14, 15 itchers, but it's still fun though. Look at him. All right, got him off that dock right there. Let's get him back in the water. This is a big one. Lucky to get it in because the hook fell right out of his mouth. Guys, look at that toad. <laughs> look at him. Yeah, that's a stout, stout fish. Man, look at that. Look at this guy. Yeah. That last fish, I, I bragged about how I uh, I cast it up under that dock right there. 
Same dock. <laughs> Cast it up under there again. Look at that stout stud. Whew. Let's get him back in the water. guys i think i'm gonna call it a day i had a really good time out here it, it took me a while to i, I still don't even i don't think i figured out anything <laughs> I, I wish i was gonna say that uh, it took me a while to figure them out but i still never really figured them out uh i think it was just uh, a war of attrition pretty much i just i just fished until i just ran out of stuff to fish um but was able to catch that one big one two under the same dock that was that was really cool um yeah, so that was fun. I had a really good time out here. Uh, as always, if you'd like to know anything about the lures or the launch or anything that I did today, you can look down in the description box. I'm gonna put some additional information down there. But while you're there, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. The channel, it is updated every week with new fishing content and new fishing adventures. So I'll be seeing you next week. This is Josh, and this is Abide Fishing. No day of fishing is complete without an accidental catfish.